Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Sebi307 here, and today we're playing the point on Blaze Black uh, ROM hack. Um, this is going to be an egg lock of point on Blaze Black, as you can probably tell from the title and uh, description. Um, basically my friend suggested this series to me, uh, his name's Eric, uh, shout out to him. And this is just a quick montage to get into the part where the egg lock actually begins. Um, being Blaze Black, it does make the game a lot harder than the normal black version. Uh, Puma have their hidden abilities and such things. Um, we only have currently a one box of uh, eggs. We're going to. Uh, Go ahead and uh, fix up a couple more boxes for uh, by the time we do a couple episodes. We're going to do them a little bit by a little bit. And um, for the first episode, we just had 30 more months to, uh, to be able to choose from, which isn't a lot. And uh, we need to get some more. And uh, I plan on doing that. Um, please stay tuned to the very end of the video. And I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Thanks for tuning in. Hello everyone, it's W3S7 here, and we just got done with that gr that montage, so... Hello everyone, it's W3S7 here, and um... We are on our new game, the Pokemon Blaze Black Egglock, and um... Basically what we are doing is we just now got to the Pokemon Center and egg lock doesn't start until you can actually receive your eggs. So we are going to go ahead and do this. Um, before the episode started you've seen this uh, super sped up montage which got us to this point. 
and I should have been talking and introducing the series. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and talk to Professor Jimmer. Ah, W3S7. There you are. Driving away the point one is truly one of the joys of being a trainer. Please follow me. I'd like to show you the most important place for a trainer to know. <clears throat> this is the Pokemon Center. Don't you feel better as soon as you step through the door? Okay, let's start your tour. Oh, wait for me. A Pokemon Center is a truly incredible place. Do you know why? Because your Pokemon can be healed. And what's more is it's absolutely free. A Pokemon Center is a trainer's best friend. Here, W307, give it a try. Hey, W307, where are you off to? Hear me and talk to the lady behind the counter. The hair to your bone. Hello, welcome to the Pokemon Center. We just sure you're tired of Pokemon to full health. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Okay, tell me your for a few seconds. Thank you for waiting. We just sure you're Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Okay, now that's your, now that your Pokemon's restored, I'll show you how to use the PC at the Pokemon Center. This is a PC. It's free for any trainer to use. You can store Pokemon in your PC boxes or select Pokemon stored in your PC boxes to take along with you. In addition, if you catch a new Pokemon while you have six Pokemon traveling with you, the Pokemon you just caught is automatically sent to the PC network. Surprising, isn't it? Amazing. Even here's something else that's cool. If you select my PC, I'll evaluate your, evaluate your project. I'll evaluate the progress you've made on your Pokedex. Professor, it says someone's PC on the screen. Who is someone? Very good, Bianca. That's a great observation. Good question, you little shit. I'd like to say more, but for now, just ignore that. Uh, go ahead and use the PC. Someone is the person who made the Pokemon storage system. Someone I'm sure you'll meet someday. Okay, let's move on. Now, this is the play barn. This is a place to buy useful items and sell the ones you don't need anymore. The gentleman over there will help you with a smile. So let's wrap up. I've given you the basics of being a trainer. We want to head back to Navuma Town now. One more final thing. When you get to Stratyon City, go and meet an interventor named Fennel. She's a friend of mine from long ago. I'm sure she'll help you on your way. Best of luck. I hope your journey proves to be the adventure of a lifetime. Oh, what should I buy? Potions of Pokemon are definitely important. I'm um, thinking. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to our options. And we won't set take speed too fast. So now we're going to go ahead and get our first egg out of the PC. And the Ella egg lock. Excuse me a second guys. <laughs> so we just fixed our box here. So we're going to go ahead and get our first plum one. So let's pull up our random number generator. And our first plum one is going to be plum one number eight. So we're going to go ahead and move that. So now we need to hatch this thing. Alright, let's see what we get. I like the egg cracking noises in this game. That's pretty cool. We get a tear pig. That's weird. I wasn't expecting to get a starter that I could have actually got. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to go ahead and name this thing. So it's a fire. We're going to name this thing Bacon. Definitely Bacon. And we're going 
go ahead and level this thing up to level 7 to match the bomb we're trading it for. So now we can go ahead and uh, box this thing. This uh, snobby that is. And we'll go ahead and put that over here. We're gonna go ahead and exit out of the PC. Sounds like something's happening in the plaza. Well, let's go have a look see. So, um. I've heard that this next, this end battle is actually kind of tough, so I'm gonna go ahead and get our next one on to the Starly. So we're gonna go ahead and weaken this thing. Now we're gonna go ahead and capture our token. There we go. So now we're going to swap this thing out and let's pull up our n random number generator and our number is 2 this time. So take this starling and swap it with 2. And Let's go ahead and hatch this thing and see what we get. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. And we get a... An Eevee! Oh my gosh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Nice, 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 nice. Uh, yes, we had to nickname it. Um, let's see... I'm going to see. I'm going to name this thing Ethan. I usually name up on the first letter. Even though it's gonna evolve. But for now, your name is Ethan. And what level was that, Starly? Let's go check here. Six. Okay, so. Go ahead and level this thing up to level six. Now some of these uh, fun ones have nickname or not nicknames, but egg moves, and some of them don't. Um, just give a little bit of diversity. Okay, so we can we actually go get a third? Oh no 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 no. No, 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 I don't want to do that. Okay, so we don't get any practice at all. So we're going to go straight into this. <clears throat> My name is Getsis, see? I am here representing Team Plasma, you see? Today, ladies and gentlemen, would you like to talk to me? I would like to talk to you about Pokemon Liberation. I'm sure most of you believe that we humans and Pokemon are partners, but that ha that we humans and Pokemon are partners that have come to live together because we want and need each other. However, is that really the truth? Have you ever considered that perhaps we humans only assume this is the truth? Pokemon are subject to selfish commands of trainers. They get pushed around and they are our partners at work. Can anyone say with confidence that there is no truth in what I'm saying? 
Now, ladies and gentlemen, Pokemon are different from humans. They are living beings that contain unknown potential. They are living beings from whom we humans have much to learn. Tell me, what is their responsibility to these wonderful beings called Pokemon? That's right, we must liberate the Pokemon. Then and only then will humans and Pokemon truly be equal, as you see. Everyone, I end my words here today by imploring you to consider the relationship between people and Pokemon the correct way to proceed. We sincerely appreciate your attention. Yeah. I need to drink. About that speech, what do you think we should do? Liberate Pokemon, that's not even possible. Oh my god, this battle is going to be hard. Your Pokemon. Your Pokemon, just now it was saying. Slow down, you talk too fast. And what's this about Pokemon talking? That's an odd thing to say. Yes, they are talking. Oh, then you two can't hear it either? How sad. My name is Ian. My name is Sharon, and this is W3S7. We were asked to complete the Pokédex when we just left out on our journey. My main goal is to become the champion, though. The Pokédex, eh? So you're going to combine many, many Pokémon and Pokéballs for that? Then I am a traitor, too. But I can't help wondering, are Pokémon really happy that way? Well, W3S7, is it? Let me hear your Pokémon's voice again. Okay, here we go, guys. Let's give this a try. So let's see what what we can actually do. So he's got a level six in Nkeda. See, oh my God, we're not even at full health. That's not good. Okay, so we got the vanish here, which is good, and he's hardened, so we're good here. We can. Go ahead and uh, get rid of this Ninkata. And that leaves us two to two, so that's a pretty good, pretty good fight right there. And look at that experience, holy cow. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of experience. Manky. Um no, no 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 no. We do not want to switch out into EV on a Mankey. So I guess we just go for embers. Be nice if we got a uh, burn on this thing. Do not focus. No no no, okay. Okay, one more button one to take down. Purloin. Sure, we'll switch out. We'll switch out into EV, give, some, give Ethan some uh, levels here. Go ahead and use this to cover it here. Let's see this. Low kick! Oh, okay, good. Oh my god, that scared. That scared the crap out of me. Gonna go ahead and take out this pearl one. And not, oh my god, Ethan didn't even level up. I, I never expected to hear such things for your Pokemon. As long as Pokemon are combined to Pokemon, Pokemon will never be um, perfect beings. I have to change the world for Pokemon because they're my friends. <coughs> huh? Strange guy. But I'm not gonna worry about it. Trainers and Pokemon help each other out. But listen, I'm going on ahead. I want to battle the gym leader in the next town, straight to Yon City. I need to battle the gym leader after gym leader. That's the best way for a trainer to become stronger is to challenge the gym leaders in each area. Okay, so a lot happened right there. Um, Bacon grew to level eight, which is pretty pretty awesome. 
We're gonna go ahead and switch Ethan to the front, and we're gonna go heal our Pokemon real quick. Yes, please. Restored your pummel and we hope to see you again. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and go to this next route up here and get us another new Pokemon. Route 2, so X -trans cross transceiver. Everybody has an X transceiver, but it's cross transceiver. W3i7, it's your mom, how are things? Are you and your Pokemon getting along and enjoying your journey so far? I need to talk to you, so I called you, but I'm gonna hang up now. W3i7, I finally caught up with you, and look how far you've come already. Professor Junior said you were probably headed to Straight Down City by now. I have another present for you, try these on. Running shoes, yes, okay. So how far are we into the episode? We probably need to cut it here. So next episode we will catch our second moment. Uh, yeah, catch our second moment, get our third moment for our team. And um, we're just gonna go ahead and skip all this. Everybody knows how to run and choose words, right? Okay. So anyway guys, we're gonna end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please uh, leave a nice little like on this video if you did enjoy, because uh, that'll let me know that you guys want some more of these, and um, please let me know if you do, because most of my series don't do any count, so I'm hoping this one will. I'm trying to, trying to be a little more outgoing, and uh, now that I've got a new computer, I'm going to try and do a lot more videos, and uh, make sure I'm producing some awesome content for you guys, so like I said, Leave me a like on this video if you liked it. Uh, comment suggestions for next series is, and for Pokemon, how to use this Pokemon. This that's another series I do. Uh, last the first episode and last episode that I've done was how to use Mega Sharpedo. So if you want to see a certain Pokemon in that, let me know that in the comments of that video. Don't put it here. Well, you can, and I'll probably see it here. But uh, whatever you want to do. Uh, let me know what you guys think and leave some suggestions and if you haven't already hit that subscribe button so you don't miss anything guys I'm going to get the heck on out of here and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.